Assalamu alaikum, my name is Sara Mehboob and I'm a tennis player here in Pakistan. I'm also part of the Fed Cup team and uh, currently I'm ranked number one. Um, lava, I have my own uh, tennis show on PTV Sports and uh, as far as my hobbies are concerned, uh, I love um, having food, I love going to different restaurants in town. In fact, a lot of people tell me I should start a food blog. Um, and then uh, iske alawa, I love watching shows on Netflix as well and um, I love spending time with animals. I have a cat at home so uh, yeah. I was always very single-minded in what I wanted to achieve as far as tennis was concerned but yeah definitely a moment that sticks out to me is a tournament I played in Jordan. It was an under-18 tournament in ITF in 2008. I was playing my first round against an Austrian girl Ju Julia Dinhoff and um, I was up 5-2 in the third set and I had a match point or Bahase I lost the match and uh, I remember I was so upset about it because that girl had actually gone on to win the tournament and uh, so that kind of really shifted my perspective and I worked a lot harder when I came back and it made me realize that you know you can win or lose a match from any point in the match and uske baad kafi aise matches hue jo maine match point down se phir jeete bhi the so um so that yeah that was a really big learning experience for me well being a girl myself i think it's so important for girls in our society to play any sport it doesn't have to be tennis just cheese ka bhi ona shock hota hai i would tell those girls to basically pursue their dreams and do whatever it is that they want to do especially because in our society unfortunately um, our parents don't support girls uh, when it comes to sports wo bas yahi kehte hain ki you know you should focus on your studies and everything which is great but i think women have so much potential in our society and most of the times it goes unnoticed because they don't really get to tap into it alhamdulillah i was very lucky that way because my parents were very supportive and i got to uh, follow my dream and but i just want to tell all the young girls out there that you should just follow your dreams and don't let anyone tell you what to do because in our society there are people who love to tell girls what to do never listen to them and just do what you feel like doing i don't really believe in telling my younger self anything because i believe that everything that happens to you in life uh, happens at the right time and in the right way even if it's something bad usually over time you see ke uski kya importance thi so um, and of course all the experiences that i've had in my life have actually brought me to where i am today and alhamdulillah i'm very happy today so i wouldn't really change anything that's happened in my life but yeah if there's one thing that i will say to my younger self i'll just you know tell her to keep working hard and keep doing what i'm doing and stay on the track uh, uh, and that it will lead to good things. So yeah, I'll, I would tell her that. Thank you so much Asjit for having me here today. Uh, this has by far been my most uh, different interview. Uh, the questions were really interesting and I had such a fun time uh, doing this with you. And uh, good luck to you as well for your coming tournaments.